Have you ever wondered about the mysteries of Machu Picchu? This ancient city, nestled in the high Andes of Peru, was constructed in the 15th century by a civilization known for their extraordinary architectural prowess, the Incas. The structures here are more than just a testament to their construction skills. They also indicate an advanced understanding of engineering and environmental management. Imagine a city built without the use of mortar, where each stone fits perfectly with the next. That's the magic of Inca architecture. But the ingenuity doesn't stop there. The Incas designed a sophisticated aqueduct and drainage system to manage the area's frequent rain, preventing erosion and preserving the city for centuries. Originally, this architectural marvel was a secret hideout for the Incan emperor Pachacuti, hidden away from the world and only known to a select few. So, we see that Machu Picchu, a marvel of Inca architecture, was not only a secret hideout but also a testament to their advanced engineering skills. Can you fathom an ancient city perched high above the clouds? Imagine this, an architectural spectacle nestled in the cradle of the Andes Mountains, standing at an impressive height of approximately 7,970 feet above sea level. This is Machu Picchu, one of the highest archaeological sites in the world. Its lofty location not only offers breathtaking views but also keeps it shrouded in the mist of mystery. Now, let's travel back in time to the year 1911. American archaeologist Hiram Bingham, on an expedition in the Peruvian Andes, stumbled upon this forgotten Inca city. A local farmer led Bingham to the ruins, and thus the world was introduced to the hidden gem that is Machu Picchu. This discovery was like a window opening to a past that had long been forgotten. Interestingly, Machu Picchu, with its intricate network of paths and staircases, offers many entry routes. However, there is no clear exit route. This curious fact adds an extra layer of intrigue to an already mysterious place. It's as if the city was designed to draw you in, but never let you go, forever ensnaring you in its enigmatic charm. The discovery of Machu Picchu by Hiram Bingham brought to light an ancient city that was both an engineering marvel and a mystery waiting to be unraveled. Would you believe that the stones of Machu Picchu hold secrets of their own? The Inca craftsmen were masters of stone, cutting and installing each piece with an awe-inspiring precision that continues to baffle experts even today. This level of craftsmanship is so extraordinary that some stones are considered smart stones. These are not your average rocks, they have an exceptional ability to absorb water, a feature incredibly useful in the often wet and foggy conditions of the Andes. Speaking of weather, Machu Picchu's location in the heart of the Andes Mountains offers a climate that's as unpredictable as it is beautiful. One moment, the sun might be shining brightly, casting long shadows over the ancient stones. The next, a thick fog could roll in, shrouding the city in mystery. And then, just as suddenly, rain might start to fall, the droplets absorbed by the smart stones ensuring the city's survival through the centuries. So, as we unravel the secrets of these stones, we also begin to understand how they've withstood the test of time and the whims of weather. The stones of Machu Picchu, with their precise cuts and unique properties, stand tall and strong, weathering the ever-changing conditions of the Andes. Have you ever considered the skies as a tool for understanding the world? The Incas certainly did, and their astronomical interests are clearly visible at Machu Picchu. Among the many fascinating structures at this ancient site, the Intihuatana stands out. This pillar-shaped stone was not just a work of art or mere decoration, but an astronomical and spiritual tool used by the Incas to observe the movement of the sun. The Incas had a deep understanding of the cosmos and they incorporated this knowledge into their architecture. They observed the sky, charted the stars and used these observations to govern their agricultural activities and religious ceremonies. The Intihuatana, or place that catches the sun, is a prime example of this. It was carefully placed to point directly at the sun during the winter solstice, the shortest day of the year. This allowed the Incas to predict the changing seasons and plan their agricultural activities accordingly. But the Intihuatana was more than just a practical tool. It was also a spiritual symbol, a tangible connection between the earth and the heavens, a place where the Incas could reach out and touch the divine. Machu Picchu, a city in the clouds, was not only a marvel of architecture and engineering but also a celestial observatory, providing a unique perspective on the cosmos.